So yesterday, Eli Manning was benched. Uh, they decided to, the Giants decided they were no longer going to play Eli Manning, and they would start Geno Smith on Sunday. Geno Smith is going to play a little bit. Their rookie quarterback, Davis Webb, will play a little bit. And the Eli Manning era has now ended in New York. What is the Giants' next move? They want to prepare for the future. The Giants want to now get a good draft pick. They've said, look, Eli Manning is in his 14th season. He's been great. Thank you for your service, but we are ready to move on from you. And now the Giants are going to say, look, Eli Manning could win us a couple more games. Or what we could do is not try our hardest to win. We're going to start Geno Smith. We're going to start Davis Webb. And we're going to have the whole, we can say, we're just evaluating how good the guys on our team are. What they're really doing. What the New York Giants are actually doing is tanking. The Giants said, look, we need a high draft pick to get a new quarterback. We're done with Eli. We love you. Thank you for your service, but we're ready to move on. And the Giants are now tanking. I don't blame them at all. That's what I would do. It's a great strategy. It's a business decision. And it really is the best thing for the Giants. Now, the biggest problem with this is New York Giants fans never got a warning. I want to I wanna thank my dad for something. It's a weird comparison, but hang in there. It'll make sense in a minute. Growing up, my dad would always tell me to say goodbye to my grandma. My grandma Jenna lived with us. She was awesome. She was a great lady. She loved Eggo waffles, kind of like Eleven and Stranger Things. My grandma was a wonderful lady. She lived with us uh, for about six years. And my dad said, every time you leave the house, say goodbye to Grandma Jenna, because you never know. You never know when you're going to come back and Grandma Jenna will be gone. She'll, she'll die eventually. And so I was always emotionally prepared for Grandma Jenna to be gone every time I came back to the house. So the day she died, I'd already said goodbye. I'd been preparing for it for months. I had a warning. If I'd never prepared for Grandma Jenna's death and she was ripped out of my hands and I had no time to prepare, it would have been so much harder to deal with. So thank you so much to my dad for giving me a warning saying, look, it's going to happen eventually. Prepare yourself emotionally. Giants fans were not able to prepare themselves emotionally. Look, it's the right thing. Eli Manning, it's time to go. It's time to break up with that girl. It's time for the relationship to end. But Giants fans weren't able to prepare emotionally. It was just ripped away. We lost our quarterback. Oh. And it's funny because, you know, six years ago, the last, any of the last 10 years, Giants fans have hated Eli Manning. It's not a rational anger. They're just angry because they didn't have time to prepare.